Welcome back to Fast Money. We are live at the Nasdaq market site in Times Square. Let's talk about liquefied natural gas and how it might arrive oh, in love Japan. It. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's so much talk about uh, disruption in terms of energy, and so mm-hmm. LNG could step in as one source, but it's got to get to Japan. It's got to get to Japan. Japan is already a gigantic importer of LNG. That's one of the main routes is to Japan, and now with some of their power offline, uh, nuclear offline, and other and, and blackouts, they're going to have more demand for LNG. The thing that's interesting about Golar is they're in the transportation of LNG, and that supply demand dynamic before Japan happened was already getting into a very full full utilization. So there's between 350 and 400 LNG tankers available around the world. There's only a handful that are available. So now with this increasing demand, you could really see day rates, day rates move a lot. And that, of course, will translate into huge profitability increases. But you have to be aware that a lot of that capacity is already signed up for long-term contracts. So don't think, if you're buying GLNG right here, or TGP, or any of those, that you're going to participate dollar for dollar in the upswing in day rates. Because the rates are already locked in. They're already locked in for a while. Now, when they right. come off, there'll be higher day rates. But don't think you're going to fully participate. Okay, let's move on here. Nikkei Future, 